Happy Thanksgiving from my family to yours. I hope you are as ready to eat all of this good Thanksgiving food, turkey and dressing and greens and uh, not potato salad. I don't eat potato salad, but hopefully, hopefully you're as ready to eat as I am. I love Thanksgiving. My favorite holiday is Christmas, but uh, Thanksgiving is right behind it. So I wanted to wish you a happy Thanksgiving. But also, I wanted to share something with you real quick. Um, so I made up my mind earlier in the year that I wasn't doing anything for like the holiday season. No, I'm not doing any kind of specials, no Black Friday specials, no Cyber Monday specials. I'm not doing any of that this year, right? But then last night as I was in the garage, I was reminded that uh, it would be selfish of me to not offer people something that could change their life and marriage if I have access to it, and I do. So that being said, I'm gonna make you an offer. Not here right now, but that's what I'm sharing the message with you about. But the thing I gotta remember is that this is God's assignment. It's not my assignment, so I can't just decide, well, I don't feel like working and I'm not gonna share this with someone. I can't do that. So uh, I was reprimanded last night and so uh, I'm going to have a Cyber Monday offer for you. But the reason for this message is because I didn't want to just create like an online offer for you to just go view and then just decide if you want to get it right. Because some of you know me, but there's a lot of you who've never worked with me. So you don't know how I work. You don't know how I coach. You don't know how I teach. You don't know how I help people transform their relationships. So here's what I'm going to do on Sunday. The day before Cyber Monday, on Sunday, I'm gonna have a one hour, maybe one and a half hour uh, masterclass. It's gonna be a marriage masterclass. I'm gonna show you how to resolve, I'm gonna teach you the best way to resolve conflict, and I'm gonna teach you the number one obstacle to resolving conflict, and here's a hint, it's not pride, okay? So I'm gonna do that Sunday, and then on Monday, I'll make the offer to you. Uh, and then let me just tell you this, the, this offer that I'm going to make on Monday it is probably one of the biggest discounts I've ever offered. And I promise it, I, this will be the last time. OK, because what I'm getting ready to do for 2024 is it's I'm so excited about it because I believe it's going to be a game changer for so many couples. I hope you're one of those couples. But um, I'm, I'm, I'm revamping the marriage course that I had last year. And so. Uh, I'm going to be making you an offer on Monday, and hopefully it's an offer you cannot refuse. But listen, even if you don't want the offer, you may say already, uh, I'm already working with him and I don't want to, and I'm not going to get another offer or I just want the free teaching. Fine. Sign up for the for the um, the masterclass for Sunday. And then that way you'll have uh, I'll have access. You'll have access to the offer. If you don't come to the masterclass, you're not going to get the offer. If you register for the masterclass, then you'll have access to the offer. The masterclass is gonna be free, but you have to register. Okay, it's gonna be Sunday. Um, and the, all the details are in the link below. Okay, so listen, happy Thanksgiving. I hope you guys enjoy your family. And listen, one more thing. For those of you who have lost people, maybe this is your first holiday season without your loved one. I want to encourage you that um, pain is just part of the process. Don't try to don't try to suppress your pain. Don't try to run away from your pain. You can hurt yourself that way. Go through the pain. Hopefully you have other people around you that can love on you. Right. But during this holiday season, I am especially praying for you. Those of you who have lost uh, loved ones. I lost my dad some years ago around the Christmas season. Uh, right. It was right after. No, it was right before Christmas, actually, in between Thanksgiving and Christmas. And so uh, I have a place in my heart for those who've lost loved ones during this time. OK. All right. So again, happy Thanksgiving. And I hope to see you on Sunday.